Norfolk City Council soon will vote whether to approve the largest budget in the city's history. There are some expensive projects on the table. And the city manager says they can afford it without any property tax increase. New at 6, Dan Kennedy tracks where the money will come from. A slice of Norfolk and the Big Apple. This bank sign in Times Square congratulates Norfolk on its recent bond sale. And while this may be in New York City, the real impacts are back home. As far as we can tell, given how it transpired, we hit a home run. Norfolk uh, City Manager Dr. Yeah. Chip Filer says that bond sale came with a low interest rate and will help fund Norfolk's nearly $2 billion budget for next year. The city has a lot of big projects underway. Uh, those projects are, are not cheap. Like other cities across America, Norfolk took a break from big projects during the pandemic. Now it's time to catch up. The new budget calls for, among other things, $93 million for a downtown seawall, another $10 million for Norfolk Public Schools, and $12 million to improve the Half Moon Cruise Terminal. Dr. Filer says that project in particular has the potential to pay for itself in three years after the Carnival Sunshine moves its home port to Norfolk in 2025. Those are the types of investments I'm trying to explain to council that we really need to, to make. But what does this all mean for taxpayers? The budget calls for some fee increases like solid waste and stormwater, but Dr. Filer says no tax rate increases. We probably don't have a lot of budget flexibility for tax decreases, given what we're getting ready to face, uh, but we really don't see any necessity to ta have a conversation about increasing the tax rate at this point. The city will also fund these projects through cash reserves and can pay them off over several years. Norfolk also gets more than $100 million a year for selling its water. Much of that comes from Virginia Beach, Chesapeake, and the U.S. Navy. Dan Kennedy, 13 News Now. And Norfolk residents have one last chance to speak up on the budget on June 6th. City Council is set to vote on June 13th. New